Three words for you. Mickey Mouse Horror. Huh? What is up you guys, Realistic Gaming here. So if you guys haven't heard, Mickey Mouse has gone to the public domain. In particular, I believe it's Mick, uh, Steamboat Mickey Mouse. If you don't know what that means, basically it lost all the copyright acts against it after Disney owning it for 95 years. Dude, that is a very long time. My grandma's not even that old. <laughs> basically what that means with uh, Steamboat Willie or Mickey Mouse, whatever, going public domain, it means that anybody can make a movie or a horror game, for example, which is what we're getting. Mickey Mouse's Trap is a horror movie and the horror game is titled Infestation 88. I mean, also, if you guys want to make a movie or a game yourself and you can make money off of it, by all means, go ahead and you will not be in trouble. All right, so with that being said, let's go ahead and check out the horror movie trailer, which is titled Mickey Mouse's Trap Official Trailer Horror Movie 2024. are the best party that we can throw. Oh, come on. Okay, so by the start of this trailer, it looks like one of those cheesy horror movies that are can either be really bad or it can be decently good from what we've seen here. Uh, also, I haven't seen the, the um, what's it called? The Winnie the Pooh movie. If you guys didn't know, they also have a horror movie on that. <laughs> I've seen some rejections in my Oh, then we got the cool guy, the jock. <laughs> Okay, so I'm not sure if these guys are in high school. Right. Do not. Yes. Oh, here comes the fun. Okay, one thing I noticed is that they're at an arcade, which is possibly they might be biting off of like Five Nights at Freddy's because of the arcade aesthetic or whatever you want to call it. Just my opinion. Oh, wow, this is Mickey Mouse Steamboat Willie. Okay, yeah, so well, is like the tape cursed? Totally disgusting. Put the phone down! Put the phone down, please! I was like, Girl, put the phone yeah. down! Yeah. Turn it on, oh, bruh! Oh, There's a Mickey Mouse right behind her. Okay, so another take at this is like, as we can see, the Mickey Mouse is not like some CGI monster. It's basically someone disguised as a Mickey Mouse killer. Which, um, I guess... It's pretty good instead of it being like a horrible CGI monster. <laughs> Which yeah, I thought would have been cool. Maybe. Right? Like if he was in a horror movie, you never say, I'll be right back. Because then you don't. <laughs> that is true, man. That's why you never separate in horror movies. Oh, look, there's a mask. All right, let's have a better look at this mask. All right, it looks like a cheap mask. I don't freaking know, but I guess it represents Mickey Mouse in a way. Or Steamboat Willie. A place for fun. A place for friends. A place for hunting. <laughs> Holy crap. The mouse is out already, bro. Where the hell did he go? Oh. I feel like they could have done better. Mickey Mouse's trap. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the mouse is hashtag the mouse is out. <laughs> All right. Wow, well, that was definitely something else. Um, like I said, I don't know. I don't know how to feel about this. I mean, in general, I feel like I like this type of narrative they're taking, where like these public domain characters come out and they make like scary movies based off of them. I just think it's funny. Some people hate it. Some people love it. I love it. I'm here for it, man. I don't care regardless. All right. So enough with that. That was uh, that was the movie trailer, Mickey Mouse's Trap. And uh, now we're moving forward to Infestation Origins official reveal trailer, which is basically the Mickey Mouse horror game Infestation 88. Let's take a look at this. Okay. Disclaimer. This game is inspired by the works that are not in public domain. Okay. Yada, yada. We've got a bit of an infestation here at the storage facility. Oh, find the source. I thought it was just rodents, but oh, look like the Mickey here. Mouse silhouette. Treat the infestation. I mean, rat infestations are no joke, right? Oh, all right, that's some stranger things, Mickey Mouse. Oh, that is a big rat, Master Splinter. Survive. Oh, heck no, there's a big old rat behind you, bro. Oh, he 
You did look kind of busted, I ain't gonna lie. Oh. <laughs> okay, cool. Oh, we see them right there in the darkness. Yeah, infestation 88. Okay, I wonder why they chose the number 88. I don't know, maybe that's when Steamboat Willie came out. I'm just going off my thoughts. I'm not so sure. <laughs> if you guys don't, let me know in the comments below. Okay, so as we can see for this game, it looks like a decent game. Like... Something you just might play with your friends when you're bored. It does look like a game that could be released like on Itch.io or like Game Jump. But as we can see now that it's a public domain, people are just going to make movies and games off of it. And uh, and just hope that the public likes it and it takes off for them. Which you can't be mad at someone for trying, you know. At least they're trying. That's the... That's the main purpose of this. All right, so I went ahead and did a little research for you guys just for the future so you can keep this in mind. So according to the, this the nationalnews.com, these are some characters that are going to go on the public domain in the near future, which are Pluto and the Maltese Falcon. So I'm assuming they're talking about like the Disney Pluto, right? Like the dog. <laughs> Imagine seeing a horror movie about that. Then Donald Duck in 2030, the year 2030. Holy crap, dude, that is... That is around six years from now. And then we got Daffy Duck in 2033. All right, that's way more longer than Superman. Okay, and Superman 2034, Batman 2035, Wonder Woman 2037. All right, so out of the six public domains, three were from Disney, and then the rest were from DC heroes, as we can see. I don't know, man. Imagine seeing like a Superman or Batman or Wonder Woman like horror movie. I feel like that would be an interesting take. I don't know. That's just my opinion. Let me know how you guys feel about this, like, characters going public domain and people twisting them into these dark characters that nobody would ever imagine. It's almost like they're trying to ruin the character, but they're not. In a, in a way, it's more for, like, the horror fans, you can say. All I know is that I'm here for it, and I can't wait to see a Batman horror movie in the future. Well, in the year 2035, when I'm in a walker, you know. All right, you guys, let me know your thoughts on this uh, Mickey Mouse or Steamboat Willie horror movie and the video game. I'm here for both of them, man. Like I said, I support this horror take that they're going on. And uh, yeah, thank you all for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.